Hey, what's going on, y'all? Okay, so Ezra and I are down here. We're doing some more saltwater fishing, but we have a little twist today. What are you going to be learning how to do today? Fly fishing! Yes, I'm going to teach Ezra how to fly fish. This is my first time fly fishing saltwater, so um, that's kind of exciting, but I'm going to teach him how to fly fish. So yeah, it's going to be fun. We uh, So we picked up this. I'm going to hold this up for the, for the team here. All right, we picked up this from Academy Sports. It was 30 bucks. Um, it's an eight foot, three piece, um, six weight. Yeah, it's a six weight fly rod. So yeah, well it's a five, six weight. But anyway, that's what we're using. Um, it was 30 bucks. If the salt water eats it up, I'm out 30 bucks, not a big deal. If you had like a really nice fly rod <laughs> and fly reel, I would make sure that they were saltwater um, approved because you can get into a lot of money with fly fishing and I was just looking to get something where I could teach him and have fun at the same time. But we're going to go out here. It's got the foam handle. I'll talk more about the fly rod once we get down here. Um, it came with a little kit and everything. It's got the line already on it, which is fine for a fly rod. Um, I normally put new line on. Um, any other kind of combo that you get, but this will be fun. And then it's got, um, gotta hold it so they can see it, buddy. Then you got um, just a couple little basic, you got a popper, just basic. You got a woolly bugger, you got a muddler minnow. Yeah, see, I kind of know what I'm talking about. I used to fly fish. But anyway, you got this, um, that looks like a little crayfish maybe. Yeah. But yeah, we're gonna have fun. We are going to have fun. We're going to go down here and fish and, oh, the flies. Check these out. I did buy some flies. Um, let's see. We have the Mylar minnow, which is that one right under my thumb. And then we have a shrimp. The shrimp, I think, I don't know. We need to get down here and look at the water and see how dirty it is. And then we're going to figure out which fly to throw. But for right now, we're going to get the pole all set up. Okay, so what you're going to do, fly fishing is not like normal fishing. It's not? No. Let's get our fly wet first. There we go. See? Get it sinking. There we go. That looks good. Show, show the big bear fishing fam here. Look at that. That's what. So you're working at like a. You're working at like a lure. Okay. Peel out some line like this. Okay. That's how you get it out. So it's the weight of the line. It's gonna be a little bit more difficult. How do you? See, and then what you do is you're gonna do this. You're gonna actually pull your line like this. See. So you're gonna, when you set the hook, you're gonna have the line is gonna be in your hand. Uh -huh. When you set, when you go to set the hook. Uh -huh. See, that tip is a little bit longer than what I like. Uh -huh. Oop. Haven't fly fished in a long time. Though it's the weight of the line that's what carries the the lure. Well, you see, you're actually using the weight of the lure. Uh, you're using the weight of the lure. And the weight of the line. See, there was a fish right there. So what we're going to do is we're going to reposition. You got to stay over this way or you're going to get hit. Let's reposition. Reposition where we just saw that fish jump. See? All right. So, let go of the line. Okay. You know, it's everything that I've taught you not to do for like a bait caster or yeah. a spinning rod. So, just peel out a little bit of line like that. Uh -huh. Okay. That's good. About one, two, just peel out just to start with. You're going to bring it back and you're going to feel the line go through the pole when you go back. So, you just like whip it back? Just 
you want to go back and you want to like here that? let's let's um let's do this let me get you started okay like pulling right out i'm not used to this because this okay so go out. back and then wait till the you have to whip it back no, 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 don't peel you. Oh, okay. I'm trying to get you started here. All right, so go. Hold the line. Uh -huh. Don't pull the line. You're going to go like this. You're going to move both hands at the same time. You're going to go back. Not like real hard, but hard enough that it whips the lure back. There you go. Now, don't bring it forward immediately. Oh. You want to let it go back a little bit. Peel. Peel? Yeah. No, hold on, that's good. That's a lot of line. Okay, hold hold the line. Right. Yes, back here a little bit more. Now go back. Whip it back. You gotta whip it or the line or the um you either you have to whip it because and you wanna keep it out away from you. Uh -huh. Keep your arm out away from you. I guess? Yeah. And then go forward just like this. There you go. Oh, I got it. That's okay. I have my hand, so I just let go of the line. Okay. Thank you. Do it again. You don't have to peel out any more line. You got to make up for what you just lost. Go, go back. Now you got to go back harder than that. You're not getting your lure back there far enough. Then go forward. Harder, a little bit harder than that. Back a little bit harder. There you go. Forward a little bit harder. There you go. Get the hang of it. Peel out some line. Back a little bit harder. No, hold it back further. Yeah, because whatever's in front of your hand, that's what you're feeding out through the guides. Oh. The 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 job of that orange line. That's your your float line, or your main line. The job of your weighted line. That's your weighted line. Think of it that way. So the weight it's weighted line because the weight of that line is what that's how you're able to fish those little tiny flies because that line keep, carries it out there yeah, I feel the line go ahead back forward perfect forward and then do i just like fish it like how do i fish it how do you fish it yeah when you fish it you're actually you're you're called like this uh, you strip back uh, yeah. Oh, hold it. Make sure you don't bring it back to the guide. Okay. okay. Do I have to reel? Well, you gotta hold the line when you reel. Okay. You don't want it to. Hold it right there. Don't get too big of a hurry. Fly fishing is about. Fishing? Man, that's a lot of bait fish. Here, let me get the guide back out because it's, it's kind of hard to get it out past the guides. Okay. All right. So now pay attention to where your lure is at too. Your lure is right there. So go back, forward. But you want to. You don't want to go straight over. You want to go like this. Keep it in an angle like this. Yeah. Keep it in an angle like this much. Feed out some line. Strip some line off of your reel. That's good. Now hold your line. No, 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 no. All the way back. Hold it back by the... There, that's the easiest place to grab it. Back. Keep your arm out a little bit. There you go. Keep your arm like this. You want to go with both arms like this. So go back with both arms. Go forward with both arms forward with both arms there you go you're getting it yeah you're getting it out there further peel it strip it off the reel a little bit okay. just a little bit then, yep back keep it at an angle don't sidearm it as much well now you got the lure too close to you there's something facing over there so you want to keep it Step over here for a second. You want to keep it at an angle. So.
it's all it's smooth so smooth back smooth forward okay so we can do this that kind of looks like a um whatchamacallit uh help me out mullet yeah that kind of looks like a mullet like a mm -hmm. minnow Ooh. this kind of looks like a minnow like yeah. a, maybe a menhaden or something yeah just with some tail or maybe a pinfish with the green yeah this is heavier this looks like a little minnow I don't know what kind, but it looks like a little minnow. To me, that looks like a shrimp. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, it could be a shrimp. Okay, so that looks like a, even though it's a mylar minnow, it could be a shrimp. And this is definitely like a little shrimp. Yeah, that's definitely a shrimp. I mean, whichever one you pick, the line is what carries the bait, so. I want to try the mylar minnow. The mylar minnow? minnow? It's going to sink faster. Okay. Okay. Hold on. All right, let's get you tied up. <laughs> you caught a fish? No, oh, you caught a crab. He, he'll break our line. Shoot. Yeah, he'll snap our line. Let go, dude. Hey, what's going on, y'all? This is the real outro. Um, we decided to stay a little bit longer. I probably needed to reapply sunscreen because I'm a little red. I'm not. I oh, know, you're good. You're still pasty. You got a little bit red on your face. Ah. Uh. It's okay. Anyway, we're going to go. That was fun. We hope you all enjoyed the video. Um, did you have fun learning how to fly fish? Yeah, that was good. a lot of fun. That makes it worth it. Okay, we will uh, catch you all next time. Make sure that you hit the like button if you like the video. Make sure that you comment if you have one. I know you do. And uh, make sure that you share the video. It's important. Make sure that you subscribe. That's really important. And take care. Take care.